23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening, I'm Jessica Harrington. Here's what's making headlines around Kern County. The winter storm moving through Kern County has shut down many of our major highways. As of 630, the grapevine remains closed in both directions without an ETA on when it will reopen. Highway 58 reopened around 430 this afternoon with CHP escorting vehicles. Highway 166 also reopening just before 5 o'clock. Highway Patrol also escorting vehicles in the area. For the latest on road closures, be sure to head to our website, turn to 23.com. Several local organizations are teaming up to host the dazzling Kwanzaa celebration tomorrow. The theme of the festive event is celebrating, building and strengthening cultural bonds, family and community. It's scheduled for tomorrow from 1 until 5 p.m. at the MLK Community Center on South Owen Street. Well, before you dump that leftover oil and cooking grease somewhere you shouldn't, there's a collection event happening throughout this month. Put your leftover oil and grease into a sealed container and take it to the Bakersfield Wastewater Treatment Plant on McCutcheon Road off of Ash in Southwest Bakersfield. City officials are also partnering with North of the River to offer a second drop off location at the NOR Sanitation District's main office on Universe Avenue off of North Chester in Oildale. The collection event will run until Friday, January 10th. Taking a look at your weather, we are checking out our future cast right now to see how this storm is expected to move out of our county. Right now, we're looking at it just into the eastern part of our county. But as we take a look into our future cast through Friday, tomorrow at about 6 o'clock, completely clear, it's going to be moving out of the county, drying up in our area. Just that residual rain and winter weather will be in effect. Now, of course, Friday, 52 degrees, the low of 36 here in Bakersfield. We're going to be in those mid 50s through about Tuesday, where we're going to hit those upper 50s and Thursday hitting 60 degrees as our high. We are tracking just one 20% chance of rain on Monday, but we'll continue to keep a closer eye on that throughout the weekend. And that's your latest news and weather update. For the latest news anytime, be sure to log on to our website, turn to 23.com.